Vessage, meet me at the harborage. We are ready to rescue Side Sahar. Put a cork in it, Tharn. Side's my friend. Probably the best friend I have. If the Vestige is going, I'm going too. Yes, I see. And you are the most qualified. Why? Is it your superior knowledge of Cold Harbor? Your expertise in dealing with Daedric entities? Or is it simply the unrequited puppy love you feel for that shirtless mammoth? I'm glad you're here. I'm about to punch Tharn in the teeth again, and I didn't want you to miss it. This cave is quite lovely, but have you seen the nightmarish landscape outside? How do you people keep your sanity? I, I believe I'll just remain indoors. Do let me know if I'm needed for anything heroic, won't you? I swear, I haven't heard such bickering and whining since the last farm family gathering at Mid-Year's Feast. The time has come for another foray into Oblivion Vestige. We have one last ally in need of rescue. Indeed, Abnathan and I have been meditating, scrying and poring over Menemarko's notes. And at long last we've discovered the location of the Halls of Torment. Our friend has suffered unimaginable and unending torment for nearly two years, far longer than any mortal man should endure. But Saisahan is something more than mortal man. He's a descendant of Leki, the Yokudan sword saint. I've seen it. We have been able to determine the precise area of the halls where Sai is being held. This is why we were so long about the task. I shall open a portal for you. Lyris and Abner have both agreed to accompany you, but I fear their mutual enmity will complicate your task. Speak with them and hear what they offer, but you must choose one or the other. You look perplexed. What inscrutable riddles is Varen spouting now? Did he? What surprisingly good advice. Tidenborn and I are more likely to kill each other than we are to help. The choice is yours. But I recommend choosing brains over brawn. I have valuable knowledge of the Daedra, and don't forget, I'm the mage. What's wrong? What did Varen say? Then your choice is clear. I've known Sai Sahan longer than anyone. I should be the one to go. It's your decision. Just know that I'd give my life for you or for Sai. Would Tharn do the same? Thank you. You won't regret it. Back in the Cold Harbor slave pits, the Shriven used to whisper about the Halls of Torment. When I think of what Sai must be going through, we'll bring him back, or die trying. Go with Lyris. Save Sai Sahan from the Halls of Torment. You made the right choice. Thorn's a snake. You want someone you can trust at your side. Come on, let's go split some skulls and bring Sai home. You're going to take the She-Troll. She has all the subtlety of a stampeding mammoth in a pottery shop. And good luck. You're certainly going to need it. The portal will deliver you into the Halls of Torment. Find Sai Saham and bring him out. He is our last, best hope if we are to locate the Amulet of Kings. Where is the Amulet of Kings? I heard about this place when I was a prisoner in Cold Harbor. It's a living nightmare. Be ready for anything. Your life to lie, Sizemar. You failed to be the sword, Sinel. You failed in your sworn duty to protect your empire. To this day, your former companions mock you for your incompetence. You are fool. You 
will not break me. Becoming a sword singer is child's play, Sai. I mastered it in an afternoon. Here. That's Tharn's voice. What is he doing here? Where is the amulet of kings? Tell me, or I'll gut you like a fish with your own sword. So close. Tharn was always mocking Sai, making jokes at his expense. Sai never responded, but I know it hurt him deeply. The Daedra must have sensed that. On the plus side, a doppelganger with Tharn's face was much more satisfying to kill. The sword singers are legendary. They were a group of Red Guard sword masters, wiped out in the first era by the Yokudan Emperor Hira. Sahan spent years trying to resurrect their lost art, but never succeeded. He considered it his greatest failure. And it took on Tharn's appearance because he was a familiar rival that Sai secretly despised. Imagine seeing your nemesis succeed where you failed. Day after day, year after year. I can't think of anything worse. We appear to have some unwanted visitors in the halls of torment. Let's make them feel welcome, shall we? Your friend always had the opportunity to free himself. All he needs to do is reveal the location of the Amulet of Kings, and you can all be on your merry way. Enjoy your visit. You'll never leave the halls of torment alive. Just tell me where the animal is and we can be together forever, Sai. Isn't that what we both want? That sounded like my voice. What's going on? I never said that. Sai's alive, but he's far from safe. We need to hurry. Stones. Destroy them quickly. This can't be real. It's not like this between Sai and me. I'll protect you, my love.
time for your next step. Vestige, hold a moment. I get my hands on Menomarco, I'm gonna slice that traitor's stem to sternum and wash my hands in his body cavity! How should I know? Sai and I are friends. Good friends, nothing more. What? No! Our friendship is based on honor and loyalty, not foolish games of love. I... I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to snap at you. This is just so unexpected. Confusing. I'll show her anguish when I bury my axe in her skull. Let's keep moving. And listen, don't mention this whole thing to anyone. I need some time to figure out what it means. First a doppelganger of Tharn, then one of me? What are these hawkers playing at? It's a wonder Sai hasn't lost his mind completely. Let's keep moving and hope he still has a soul to save. We don't get many visitors in the Halls of Torment, but there's always room for a few more. Permanent ready. <laughs> such tenacity, such ambition, such bravery. Such a pity we're going to skin you alive and feast on your intestines. in the halls of torment. Whether it takes a day or a thousand years, Sight the Harm will be broken. Take it. Where is the Amulet of Kings? Where is the Amulet of Kings? This can all be over if you just tell me. You can finally rest. You'd like that, wouldn't you, Sai? Have I been here two years? Two thousand years. I, I can no longer tell. But I will never break. Never! I should have never trusted you! sent you. The Emperor? He lives? 
This day is filled with wonders. They tortured me for many months. Years, perhaps. But I did not break my vow. The amulet is hidden and safe. My strength is returning. Lead on. You have done it, Vestige. Bring him through the portal, quickly. sai has been through a lot, but it looks like he can walk on his own. That's a good sign. We did it. We got him. Sai's going to be all right. Thank you. It is bad luck to owe a life debt to a stranger. So I've decided that you are my friend. Know that my people do not take such things lightly. If by life or death I can serve you, I will do so without hesitation. Sahan looks relatively healthy, but there's no telling what sort of toll years of torment will take upon the mind. It will be interesting to see. I do hope we're done here. I have an assignation with a young lady. Sai Sahan lives. You've outdone yourself, Vestige. The minds of some men can endure hardships far greater than anything that Daedra can concoct. The forces of loyalty, honor, and friendship are powerful indeed. We must recover the Amulet of Kings, but only when Sai Sahan has had time to recover. He is a man of great strength, but he will still need to rest after such an ordeal. Sai locked the Amulet away in the ruins of San Crator and entrusted the key to one of his close associates. But he can tell you himself, speak with him. He is eager to meet his liberator. I'll contact you when we're ready to move forward. I owe you my life. My lord calls you Vestige. A strange name. Is it true your soul was taken from you? Stranger still. My people say that bravery and honor are the hallmarks of a great soul. Yet you have both of those things in great measure. I had begun to think that honor was a relic of the past. You give me hope. I cannot say. Physically, I am unharmed. But mentally, I feel a darkness in my heart. A weight on my soul. I do not know how long this emptiness will remain. I hid the amulet in a sacred catacomb protected by magical wards. The means of lifting these wards are in the keeping of my old mentor, Kasura. As soon as I am able, we must meet with her. I will try to rest, but I am a warrior. We cannot sit still for very long. <coughs> and I should certainly bathe before we meet with Kasura. I am unpleasantly fragrant. And if she happened to be downwind of me, well, I would never hear the end of it. The path ahead of us is a dark one, but it pleases me to know that I shall walk the path with friends. May we all rest a little easier tonight. I know I shall. My wounds are superficial. They will heal in time. But the debt I owe you will never be erased. I am honored to call you friend.
When Saitahan has recovered, you must accompany him on a journey to the Valley of Blades, where his mentor Kasura resides. I will contact you as soon as he's ready to travel. We did it. Sai's going to be all right. I have a favor to ask. Let's not talk about what happened with that doppelganger. Not yet, anyway. I... I had no idea Sai so had feelings for me. I just need time to sort it all out. Sahan seems to be relatively unharmed. Can we wrap this up? I have an appointment with a certain young lady, and I need to stop by the money changers first. Women of that stripe seldom do anything on credit. <laughs>